It was just another day in Inferno Rus. Scavenging, searching, surviving, until I made it to the VMC. I realized instantly that I came across the path of a cannibal, or more. Not only did I find one pile of human meat, I found two. And this is that story of me hunting the cannibal. Enjoy. The heck is this? I just spawned in. Is this normal? Did he commit suicide? How did he get military gear here? I just, I just started playing. I mean, shoot, dude. I, I'll, t I'll take it, man. Hell, hell yeah, dude. This is pretty freaking dope, honestly. The heck are the, uh... Oh. Hi! Do you have, uh, in-game chat? What the heck is that? Whoa! <laughs> Screw you, dude! Oh my god. Bleeding now. Hopefully you don't bleed out. You shouldn't have flipped me off, man. Why are you so hostile? Oh yeah, yo. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's love. It's love and hearts now, isn't it? I know. No, no, no. I don't believe you. No way, dude. No way. This is my first time on this server too. Yeah, die. Take all your trash. Well, that was fun. The heck, dude. Take that, take that, take those bandages as well. Kind of beat me up. What the frick was that? After this very strange, fresh spawn encounter, I made my way west to the Topolka military base. Small little military outpost surrounded by sandbags and only has a few military tents with questionable military gear. I was hoping to find a gun, handgun, AK, M4, scorpion, shotgun, anything that could have helped me defend myself against future threats. I was not so lucky though this time. I found more appropriately styled apparel, green colors for the forests, but that's it. I made my way north to another military outpost. God dang, dude, they are having some fun. I wish I could have fun. But unfortunately, as of right now, I am freaking stuck trying to find a weapon to do something with. Unfortunately for me, no weapon would be found. This base, though it was larger, was quite useless. Frick. Well, on we go. Finally found a, a, a weapon. And uh, ran into a daisy bug where I can't put any rounds in the magazine, so that's that's really cool. I can't I can't I can't remove the magazine to put weapons in there. That's really neat. Oh hell yeah! Oh th yep, thank God I can empty it though. Thank goodness. Oh yeah, love that. Might as well just put this thing down. Pretty much worthless. 
Freaking stupid, man. Unbelievable. Oh, great. This one's better. I don't care. Down you go. Here, here hello. How you doing? Caribbean 98, you know, I like that. No magazine, but you know, who 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 cares? At the end of the day, you know, you don't I, I don't know if you take any of the ammo I have. Seven seven nine two five seven. Don't even got it. I don't even got it. And you know what? Who cares? Because at least I can load that one. Alright, on my way. So uh yeah, I'm sick from cholera or whatever, and I can't keep anything down. This is how I die. This is how- I don't even know how I got it. I didn't even eat anything with bloody hands. I didn't drink any water. This is insane. This is my first experience on this particular server. Holy crap. Let's see if I can't just nibble a bit. Nibble a bit. Alright, let it sit. Nibble a bit. Nibble a bit. Alright. We'll just chill out there. I'm totally gonna die. I was white hunger, man. I had it all. I had it all. I had what health? We got some winnie rounds. Hell yeah. Probably won't get a chance to use those. Alright, let that sit. Yeah, I'm, I'm just about dead. I've almost had a whole can of peaches. This is the freaking worst. You know, this is just the worst. Oh, yellow? Nope, back to red. Back to red. I don't get yellow. Yellow? Alright, back- okay, cool. We're yellow. Let's go. Oh, I'm blinking red and white, man. I am blinking red and stinking white. Give me that yellow water, please. Give me the yellow water before I perish. Get it up. Give me it. Give me it. Give me it. Turn yellow. Turn yellow. Turn, 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 please, please turn yellow, please turn yellow, I beg you to please turn yellow, why are you going down, come on, just a little bit man, get, yes, yes, stop blinking, go up, stop blinking, stop, stop it, stop it, stop, I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Is there a medical center here? No, there's not. Holy... Okay, you're going back up. That's good. This is the most stressed out I've been. I, it looks like I'm staying here for a bit. I'll let y'all know what happens. Okay, just an update. I have gathered some supplies. I have started my fire. I'm cooking my meat from the sheep that I have slain in cold blood. And as you guys have seen, I have carefully fed and hydrated myself to where I'm back in the white, just barely, and I am now in red, not blinking, regaining. I should be back in yellow anytime now. I don't know what that little zombie deer symbol is there, and I don't know why it says 75, but there we go. After regaining enough health to where I felt comfortable moving from my location, I traveled to the Starry Sober Military Complex but it appeared that others had been there before me. Well, there certainly was somebody here. I just spent a minute walking around up hills. I'm not seeing any signs of anybody, man. W were there people here, or was it just like, or was it just really weird spawning? Because that's a freaking M24 sniper rifle that takes the freaking Winnie, dude. That's awesome. Because <laughs> I, cause I, I got that. I got that Winnie. I need to find a magazine though. That's hot though. I, I like that. Not the worst iron size, but they still kind of blow, don't they? Like, look at this. I, I guess they must have had something better? I've been following shots this whole time, so I'm hoping that once I actually get some decent gear, I'll be able to keep running over there and join in the fights. But, uh, as of right now, I still have Chloria, Chloria, or Chlor whatever the frick that it, that little disease is that makes me thirsty all the time. And it really freaking sucks, dude. Really bad. Rangefinder is always welcome. Thank you. Yeah, it sucks, man, because it dehydrates you, and you can't eat or drink for prolonged periods of time, because then you vomit, 
So I can't trap my travel is severely limited because of this. I haven't even found a water bottle, which really makes traveling difficult. <laughs> All right, so I ran south to the town of what the hell is that? Net Nedizda to the hospital. And my goodness, I found tetracycline pills. I am so happy. Take a few of these. One pill at a time, let it run its course, and I should be free from this stinking disease, and I can finally start making some headway on this freaking playthrough, dude. So annoying. Oh, also, I planned ahead. In case I get into a firefight, which I'm hoping I do when I get shot, and I suffer from blood loss, I collected some of my own blood in this blood bag so I can quickly recover. Hashtag smart, hashtag blessed. Alright, so I'm just going to chill out here for a minute, and uh, yeah, take these pills. Guys, it's a gosh darn miracle. One pill, one pill. I let it go through its life cycle, and I am freaking cured. You see that? No longer will I be running and having triple down arrow. No longer will I be sitting and having double down arrow. Now... I will have a regular double down arrow while running, and no down arrows. Well, maybe one down arrow. While sitting. O-M-G. I am freaking pumped. And I got a scope for my sniper! I am ready to battle. I'm gonna get water while I'm here, and then we're heading west, boys and girls. For glory. I'm really excited about that. I'm so proud of myself. I healed myself. I don't need nobody. I got it. And so my goal is clear. I needed to head to the VMZ and find those shots that were ringing across the map, beckoning me to glory. I did not know who it was. I did not know how many. I did not know anything about that person or people shooting. But what I did know is that they were mine. So I went there, and I began tracking and looking for signs. Someone's been here recently. They very well might still be here. It's a stinking pipe! I like pipes, but they do give off that smoke, man. Look at that. Cannibal? Cannibal. Twerp a freaking human. This is weird. Locked zombies in this freaking room. What the heck? I saw the pipe. I see the meat. Before I got here, I wasn't recording, but I saw skinned animal. I mean, I guess he must have kept moving west. That's just weird, though, man. Can't. Like, what the heck? There's plenty of meat. Nah, he went north. He went north. Let's see if we can't find him up there. And so I ran north, but instead of going to the airfield military base, I decided to go to Vibor. There was a large tower that I was able to climb up on. I had binoculars and I decided it would be a pretty good vantage point in any direction. Was it risky? Yes. If anybody just looked up, they would surely see the human silhouette on top. But no one did. I proned, and I looked. And ultimately, 
I found. There. What the heck is he doing? There's two of them, it's a team. Shot. I had hunted down and killed my target from the east side of the map finally to the center of the map. It took hours, but it, it felt so good. The only question now is, was there somebody else? I only saw, while editing, that there were two people running ahead of the cannibal, and he shot one that left one more threat. But I do what many Daisy players do, and I stalked the perimeter of my kill. I did not approach the corpse to loot so greedily, so quick, somebody could still have eyes on the corpse and off you right next to them. But the question is, did I wait? long enough. And where is his dead body? There it is. Must have been somewhere up there then. Is that a dead body right there? He killed him and then I killed him. What great timing. Alright, well let's see what this guy has. This guy's so freaking mad right now. I won't take his AK. He has a lot of ammo for it, man. And that is the end of my story. Although the question still remains. Did I kill the cannibal, or did the cannibal just kill me? I suppose I'll never know. But what I do know is, I should probably wait a bit longer before I go into loot. And I should loot a bit quicker. Thank you guys for watching this whole thing. If you did, that means you enjoyed it and you found value in it. So please consider subscribing, leaving a comment, sharing it with people that you think would enjoy hunting cannibals. And I will see you guys in the next one. Path out.